have you seen Volk's head, mate? His head is made of steel. UFC Bantamweight tilt. I'm sure, I'm sure. All right, so here we are back at Bell Center here in Montreal, Quebec, Canada, and D.C. This is the loudest MMA venue that I have ever been in in my life. John, I feel the same thing. UFC 124. When I walked out of the back to Josh Koscheck, I had never heard anything like the crowd in the Bell Center before he fought George St. Pierre. These people cheer, and they cheer loud for their guy. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Watch right hand is true. Just misses with the right. Oh, and there's a land with the kick. So certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Oh, for a combination kick. lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy oh. and also staying active. Big punch lands. Ooh. I was expecting that to go to the body. Oh, he leads with the right hand there. A lot of these strikes are set up by good footwork, yes? They are set up by good footwork, and he's not having to throw the jab every time because that right hand is just so fast. This striker has come out swinging, and he's a very aggressive guy, but you got to be careful, I would think, to not overextend yourself. Yeah, you would think you got to slow down, but not this guy. This guy knows that he can secure finishes on the feet or he can take down to his back. But ideally for him, he wants to be knocking guys out. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Much in front. Oh! Yeah, right. He's, He's hurt bad. Oh! Oh! That was actually fake, but I'll take it in. Oh, why? Chico Vera is hard. Gary, uh, one two head kick for the win. He blocks the punch. What a fantastic strike to throw. And why are you staying in the pocket, mate? He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. And just missing oh. with that big yeah, right. hand. Round two is next. Respect oh. in it. Second round underway. Big ball for punch lands. Now we'll get back to range. O'Malley's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Why are you shooting for takedowns? Wow. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very much. It's just delayed body kick. But you know about the tactics. Yeah, right. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Watch this delayed body kick. We know. Yeah, right. Should have went to the head. That would have been an easy KO. In. Watch this, watch this. Oh, so I told you, we you know about the tactics. GG in